Good morning, Patriots. Today is Wednesday, December 4th, and this is your Patriot Press News. I'm Jacob Caffey and here are your announcements for the day. 300 seniors have submitted their FAFSA and CATA applications. There is still time to get two extra graduation tickets. Submit your FAFSA and CATA applications by December 31st and you'll receive those two extra tickets. Your Heritage Astronomy League is having another meeting in W226 tomorrow during first lunch. Make sure to make your way over to learn more. We are super excited to bring a new weekly segment today. As avid students know, Wednesday is College Highlight Day. And each week we'll bring a new interview highlighting different colleges and talking with teachers and that we all know and love. So before we get to club news today, let's check it out. I don't want to have my gum chomping. That would be not. I went to San Diego State University. The transition from high school to college was really difficult for me. My first semester I got a 1.4 GPA and my second semester I got a 1.8 because I was having a lot of fun. But then I worked it all out and did really well and the transition ended up being smooth but the first year was really tough. <laughs> for while well, I have to say first and foremost partying, to be really honest with you, San Diego State is one of those colleges. But nowadays, it's really known for its academics and sports, as well as basketball and football. I did do four years, and the experience was absolutely incredible. My recommendation to anybody is to pick a college that is in a city that you want to be in, and there's no better place than San Diego. So the experience was great. And my girlfriend slash wife went there with me, too. Yeah. My major was business administration and the emphasis was in hotels and restaurants, which is what I worked in for a long time before I became a teacher in my mid-30s. Only one that would be an official extracurricular as part of the school was the ultimate Frisbee team. I was on that team that competed against other colleges around California. Oh my gosh, what a great experience. Our, our field that we played on was the Aztec Bowl, and then we would have all our competitions down at the beach at Rob Field and Ocean Beach. So does it get any better than being 20, 21 years old and playing Frisbee with a bunch of people in a park by the ocean? It was a great experience. The biggest tip for a senior that's going to be going into college is, well I have two. One would, and I alluded to it a minute ago, one would be to select a college based on not just the university but what the surrounding environment provides like what San Diego provides because hopefully you'll be able to live in that city afterwards and if it's somewhere you love then it's a beautiful thing. And then my other recommendation would be to not stress out too much and just kind of let the chips fall where they may. My dream college was University of California, Santa Barbara. I didn't get in. I ended up getting to go to San Diego State and my life was beautiful as a result. So just roll with it and make it good. Hey Patriots, it's your Society for the Promotion of Empowered Women President here, Aramis. And your Vice President, Naraya. Our hopes for the club is to promote the education of intersectional feminism both on and off campus. It's come to our attention that female and LGBTQ students have been harassed, groped, or verbally assaulted, and we want to create an environment that's both, both peaceful and equal for all. We will be meeting in room W103 from 3.30 to 4.30 every Thursday after school. Some ideas we have are a women's clothing drive, an LGBTQ support group, and breast cancer awareness donations, and more. But this can only be possible if you join us. So come in, come out and join the SPEW Club. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Hey, hey Patriots. Patriots. This Thursday, we're hosting our annual winter holiday concert. The doors open at 545, and the show starts at 630. You can buy your tickets at ASB or at the front of the door during the concert. Tickets are $5 for adults and $3 for students or anyone 18 years and under. Please come out and support your music department here at Heritage. If you have any more questions, please contact Mr. Moen in the band room. 
We hope to see you there. Hey freshmen, your fellow ASB officers are hosting a movie night this Friday in the quad. The movie will be starting from 5.30 to 7.30 and we'll be watching How the Grinch Stole Christmas. Be sure to come early to enjoy some free hot chocolate. See you guys there. ASLers, bring a friend to Washington 112 on Wednesday, December 11th. During lunch for assigning social, decorating handy holiday cookies. What's good, Heritage? We are your BSU Executive Council members. This week is BSU's annual Cons of Spirit Week. And on Wednesday is Ugly Sweater Day. Thursday, Christmas at Day. And Friday is Pajama Day. Meet BSU in the quad during both lunches to get a ticket, and then Friday you'll get a treat. Just to remind you guys, BSU is hosting a showcase. If you guys are interested, come see us in the quad and you guys can sign up. If you guys have any more questions, you can email Miss Cammon. Bye! <laughs>